Today I'm working on my two year. Yesterday I came out here and uh, I was sick. I'm still kind of sick today. I'm not feeling real great, but I uh, had two days in a row where handyman stuff got kind of canceled on me. And what I've been doing is looking at building my two year for my forge. And what I had done, the, the problem is, um, I also got a haircut. Um, Anyways, now the problem is, uh, most people use just two inch pipe fittings, like um, a, a few two inch pipe nipples, and a uh, pipe tee, and a, and a cap, and what they'll do is basically, um, so anyways, normally what you do is you have your forge, you have your fire pot, and your two-year comes out the bottom, and there's a T comes off, and then there's another nipple here, and they'll put a pipe cap, and then they'll run a piece off this direction, and that's where your blow blower sits is over here, um, depending on what kind of blower you've got. But anyways, uh, the idea is air is forced in here, up through the bottom, into your through a fire grate. And some of them will or they may or may not have a, a clinker breaker, but anyways, your your coal sits in here and and the air comes in here and injects a little bit of oxygen, makes that fire really hot. Ashes that happen to fall through the grate end up down here, and every so often you pull the cap off and you you dump your ashes. My problem is I don't want to pay a lot of money for uh, pipe fittings from a place like Home Depot and Lowe's and those uh, those places like that. They wanted like I think they wanted fourteen dollars for galvanized pipe tea, which uh, doing handyman work I charge about eighteen dollars an hour, so that's almost an hour's labor for a part that is not going to be anywhere near taxed to what its actual service duty is. So I decided to build my own. So I'm digging through my scrap and I found. Uh, three lengths of two inch pipe to some scrap from old projects and I've got what's interesting here is I've got these two here are both scheduled 40 and what I will do is it looks like this one here probably the better one I will just cut a hole in this in this piece I'll weld that Okay, I think that went pretty well. That's the basic structure of it. Now I just need to build the ash, the, the door for the ash dump. So I don't know. It's uh, yeah, you can see down in there. That's the opening. So I'll my blower at this end, 
and I'll probably build a little flange to go here of some sort. I can bolt, bolt a blower to it, and it'll come through. Along here, and then up, and the ashes come out the bottom, just like magic.